All right, guys, so Spider-Man Far From Home is about to get its second trailer. This is going to be the big one. This is the one post-Avengers Endgame, which originally it was delayed because it had a giant spoiler. So let's talk about this and uh, what we can expect from it, when you can expect it to drop, and uh, probably get out of this video if you haven't seen Endgame. Okay, so first and foremost, we now know that there's been a giant seismic shift in the MCU. Spider-Man Far From Home takes place five years after Avengers Infinity War. You know, it's kind of insane, but the show is going to the future now. Characters have aged and moved on. Um, we see Peter still in school because he was dusted, so things are going to be rather interesting. And of course, his mentor, Tony Stark, is dead. The world's got to move on, and so does Peter. So this is all, I'm assuming, going to factor into some of the dialogue and things in the trailer. That's why it was specifically delayed, because it was originally set to drop before Avengers Endgame, but Marvel was like, dude, this includes spoilers, don't put that out there. You know, death and all, so makes a lot of sense. So that's what you can expect in this trailer. Now, when exactly is it going to drop? Well, it could drop as soon as tomorrow, but realistically, people are expecting it's going to drop by Thursday, of next week specifically to be attached to the upcoming Pokemon movie and if some theaters can to add it to future showings of Avengers Endgame which makes a lot of sense and obviously this is going to be the trailer that plays pretty much throughout the rest of the week so leading into Dark Phoenix being attached there and then of course you know to home with Spider-Man Far From Home. So, uh, realistically, uh, the trailer is about to drop anytime now, and this is going to be the story trailer. This is the one people want to get more details and a bigger look into the MCU and what some of these characters are going to be like with this giant shift in the uh, universe. And honestly, I can't wait to see what exactly is being presented here.